Hi guys, welcome to another video of Fortinet and in this video we will try to add Fortinet firewall image in our ENG and we will try to set up and launch it. So let's start and I will provide the image in the description. So first thing first, we need to go and log in on our ENG. Okay, I can show you again how to do it. So just uh, from start. So win SCP and just log in on this. So root, okay. And you connect to your image. So I'm gonna connect. So I'm connected. Now the first thing is you need to go onto the root folder. Once you go on the root folder, look for a folder called opt. And uh, let me see, opt is here. Sorry, opt. Okay. And in opt, look for the folder called Unilab, Unilab add-ons, and add-ons folder called Kimo. And in this one, you need to create a folder, and folder has to be like this, 40 nate dash fgtv small and whatever the version that you want to give it, okay? So just give it like this. So if you create like this, you won't have any issues because it has to be uh, the this naming convention has to be the same. Okay, the 40 need to match. After that, this one you can give any. So click OK. Once you click OK, then on this one I have this image here. So I will copy across. Let's wait for the copy. Okay, once this is done, now I will go and will apply this permissions by log through the putty. So once I see this one here, I will go on putty and I will log in on the same image 192.168.152.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.
port one. If you remember, we connect here with the port one, which is showing here as well. Now, once you go into that, then say to mode is static. So the port mode will be static. We would like to give it a IP address, not DSCP, but a static. So say it IP 192.168.1. Well, I will choose a different one, but it's up, up to you guys, whatever you want to give it. So my ENG is 152.133. I will give this as a 135 and a subnet mask 255, 255, 255, 0. And allow access. So set allow access. So I would like to allow ping HTTPS and management portal my port and HTTP and SSH. Okay. Once I allow this, then I click on the next and click on end. Once you do that, you still would like to see the show interface sorry show system interface and then it will show you the ip address here okay once you show see the ip address there just go here and straight away log into this okay happy days once you see this portal it's just easy peasy admin and your password Just take a moment, so wait. I unable to connect, contact server. Authentication. Just took a moment. Okay, once you see this, it's up to you, you want to to whatever you want but look I will say begin and just give it a name so I just keep the same name and click OK OK don't show it again click OK and that's it we are in OK and now in our next video I will show you how to set up the ports and the interfaces and which way our lab will be working and which way we can set up the router, connect the router and the, for the network. If you like this video, please subscribe our channel and thanks for watching this. Thank you.